welcome back to my channel my name is Shanette and if you're new here and you like my content please to support my channel by clicking the like button also don't forget to subscribe so you'll be notified the next time I drop a video so I'm not really doing an unboxing or whatever you guys want to call it but of course I ordered some stuff from Timu I have stuff from Timu Target and Amazon. Just stuff I want to share with you guys. I want to, you know, I'm, I'm designing my one of my kids' room is black and white, and I'm designing it into black and white with a little bit of twist of the black and white checker design because I'm so obsessed with checker design. So I ordered some stuff, you know, to go in their room, and also some other stuff. I'm just going to show you guys that I got. So let me bring this down a little bit. Some more. Oops, too far. Okay, that's good. So, oh, show my address. So first, let me pull out my dress. You know, I washed my dress and I think it shrunk. So, I got this from Timu. This is for my kitchen. Let me open it up. So, these are mittens with the, the silicone in the back. I like these. These actually feel better than the last one I ordered. From them this one feels feels good and I'm also gonna um, put the price on the screen and also I'm gonna put the links to all these items in the description I bought different types because I'm just trying out stuff guys to see which one I like better and I got this one as well so it looks inside. Um, I guess it goes like this. Checker, it feels good. But for some reason, I like this one better. This one has more of a quality feel to it. This one is nice, but this one just feels sturdy. And this, oh, I got pillowcases. Not pillowcases. I've got um these are for 18 by 18 pillows. I already got some checkered pillows for my kids' room that I, I bought in Home Goods. And um I didn't want to go and buy the same type, so I just ordered the pillow the cushion cover and I'm gonna put um 18 by 18 um maybe chop um fillings fell down inside of these and this feels good the texture of this feels feels very good guys very soft and i'm trying to see if the material what type of material hold on because it feels very soft But there's no tag in it. But I know the, the material was online when I was purchasing it. But there's no tag in here. I don't remember if it was polyester. I don't remember. But yeah, I ordered two of those. So it should be two. Yeah, those two. And they already have two. So now they're going to have four. So that's that. I love that. That feels like quality. This is... Uh, the mitten that goes with this this one right here I like it it feels feels very good it feels like real good quality and it wasn't so expensive I really do like this and I like the way how this is design the way how they cut it like it's not straight across it's like to the side so I like that I'm pleased with that also order some more spoon 
on my um, coffee and tea area. I saw these on Amazon and I went to order them on Timu. And they have them in gold as well, different colors, but you know, my team is silver. So I've got it's a set of five and I'm gonna link the price and stainless steel for my tea area. And I also have some other one that has embedded wires on them. So I wanted to like look for my tea area where I keep the tea, these spoons to look filled out. So I also have some more coming as well. Different style. And this is, don't know yet. You're about to find out. <laughs> Oh, and I know it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be two of this. These are um, they're two polka dot bowls. Yes, so there are two polka dot bowls in black and white because that's a part of my team as well. My kitchen, black and white. Stainless steel, um, gray, and natural, natural wood. So, these are bowls, like two little cereal bowls. Um, I wish it was a little bigger, but it's not bad. I hate these things and it makes so much mess. So yeah, and they came with two spoons. So this is what it looks like. I wish it was a little bigger. And it's ceramic and spoon as well. The spoon is ceramic as well, but spoon is on the bigger size, a little big. For cereal? I don't know. Cereal, oats, I don't know, but yeah. It's two. Perfect size for how I eat because I eat very little. I don't eat a lot. And this is, I think, the rug. I'm trying to make mess with this guy. Hold on one second. I hate these little things. They make so much mess. And this is a non slip rug that I ordered for my kids room. I was kind of worried about the quality, but let's see. Usually I read reviews before I order. And, oh, did I cut it just now? No. Did I cut it? Yes, it's checkered. Okay, non slid. And I think it's made from polyester. It says machine wash in cold and gentle water, no chlorine, and it's 100% polyester. It says tumble dry and low. Yep. So this is it. I think it was a low pile because for my kids I don't want the pile to be too high something very low that they can maintain so this was low pile it feels very 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 soft and I like that it's machine wash and the nonstick at the back feels like very good quality it's definitely a good quality non-stick I just hope it holds up after I wash it but I'll wash it on gentle gentle wash so I don't damage it but yeah it's good size big size big enough for the spot where I want it oh and this I ordered from Amazon it's a double um mitten 
for my kitchen my kitchen stove i'm not ready to use this yet because i already have one that i damaged and after washing it i washed it with bleach which i wasn't supposed to it says no i had no bleach but there was a little stain i couldn't get that stain out and i sprayed a little bleach on it and it damaged it so i'm not ready to use this one yet so wait, let's get all the timu out the way so we got this from timu again and I did open it and kind of peep on some of the items, but not all the way. I just took a little peep. So this, okay. This is like a little hanging basket to hang stuff. I mean, to put your stuff in. I don't know like what you want to put in it. I don't know what this is for. I don't know what that's for yet i guess something oh it's to hang oh, okay so this is to nail in the wall you don't have to use this so this is for you see right here the nails and you have to like nail it down like that into the wall and then you put it into here and you hang it and you just put whatever you're putting in it i don't know it smells it smells awful it smells like mildew yeah it's, I definitely have to wash it it smells, it smells like mildew it smells very moldy but it's nice and sturdy I don't know what to put in it but I just like it it gives me like a boohoo vibe I like it but the smell, guys. Woo! You don't have to use this nail one. You can use your own nail, but I like that they they put this in there for you as well. And this right here, this is some bathroom hooks in black, stainless steel black. That's what that is. I like them. Very nice. So, I think I ordered two sets of six. One, two, three. Yeah, so it's 12. It's 12 of them. And that's that. Okay, and this, I can already tell there's a problem with this one. This is supposed to be a paper, a paper towel holder, but as you can see, definitely not a paper towel holder. This is a toilet paper holder. Like, they're not no freaking English. This is definitely for toilet paper, definitely not for no damn paper towel. What paper towel is going to fit on this? None. No, this is for toilet paper. They played me with this one. It's still nice though for paper towel. You know, like... The whole vibe. Both can go together. But we'll see, we'll see. So yeah, got that. Let me put it back in the bag. I don't know the smell of that um of that that bag. That hanging basket. I don't like the smell. Let me put it back in here. Was it in here? I think so. Smell real bad. I'm going to shoot it on the bush. It smells bad. Okay. And this is supposed to be a basket. I 
so it's a guy like i'm coming out with the flu so this is supposed to be a basket it's very nice well made it's very sturdy as you can see it's very close together i don't see no gaps and it's it's not sliding or slipping it's very well made very sturdy it got um some type of steel metal around the edge i can feel it keep it together and i don't i already have a fruit basket my fruit basket is marble real marble i paid like 200 and some dollars for that so i'm probably going to use this you know to put maybe like my i'm always um ordering like i'm always buying like plantains and bananas green bananas and green plantains so i'm probably going to use it for this um i don't eat potatoes anymore so i would say for potatoes but i don't eat potatoes anymore so i cannot use it for potatoes so yeah i'm definitely going to use this for green bananas and my plantains so that's that and then what else we got no, that's it for timu can't wait to show you guys you know my designs and what i'm doing and what i'm changing around and stuff like that you guys are gonna get it you're gonna get to see everything so don't think that i'm just gonna show you items items that don't show you what i'm doing how i'm designing you're gonna you're gonna get to see it all and this is what the hell is this Oh, from Amazon. Okay. I thought it was Timu. I'm like, I only ordered one rug from Timu. Okay, from Amazon. This is a rug in the checker design that I want to put in my kitchen. It's a runner. I love runners. A kitchen and bathroom. All I use. Mostly runners. Runners, runners. So this for my kitchen i'm telling you when i said i went through so many of them when i was looking and reading reviews and just couldn't make my mind up and i went with this one because this one had the best reviews so and this is cotton uh, let me see i don't remember if it's 100 percent cotton but i know it's cotton so it's 45 percent cotton and 45% polyester and 10% viscose or viscose, whatever that is. I don't know. I've never seen that before. But yeah, so this is what it looks like. They use blue tread to sew it. You can see in the back here, blue treading. Hmm, interesting. Let's check if it's coming off. Mm, gotta check make sure nothing is coming out at least it's not stink yeah i love it and it was uh how many i'm gonna slink the exact one i got because i know they said one was small and if you want it's like three different size and um i wanted mine to be like across the kitchen across from my kitchen counter kind of going back towards my um i have to show you that i can't explain it because it's not like you're seeing it where i can tell you you know what it is i have to show you like the distance you know how i wanted it so this was a perfect size for what i wanted for and i checked the measurement i went and measured in my kitchen before i order it so yes so as you can see so as you can see you see where i'm going right the whole checkered yes and i also got something else another mitten that i ordered from amazon as well but we're gonna get to it okay so this right here let me see 
Okay, yes. Here's the other. Here's the next mitten I was telling you guys about. Can you stop? So this goes with this. Yes, yes, yes. I'm obsessed. And I don't think they're the same brand. They're not the same brand, but I searched and I found them. Two different companies, but it looks the same. Colors are a little bit different. Different in white. One, you know, one has a darker white, one has a more oh, one has this one's more soft white. This one's like bright white. Which I don't mind. I don't care. I'm not gonna put this in my kitchen just yet. Let me use the T1 ones first. Yeah, so this right here that I'm opening is I don't know if you guys see my video and I have the Alexa Show 10. Hey, you can come. Come here. I want to show you this. I have the Alexa Show 10 in my kitchen. And Amazon had these ones for sale. The, the original price is $250. And I got the first one on sale. And I saw this one again yesterday actually on sale and I had to jump on it except for this time I got a different color so this one is not white this one is what's the other one the other one I, the other one I have is something right in there so this one is black. Wow. Yes, guys. Yes. I don't know what I'm going to do with this one because I already have one in my kitchen. Look at this, guys. This is a coral, the one in coral. I just had to have it. I just had to have it. It was, um, and the reason why I got it so cheap, the first one I got was, I got it from, um, on Peak. I bought it in Peak. This one I got, it was like, you know when somebody buys something and they return it and it says like new? That's what this one was. Like new. And I got it for a hundred and 41 dollars i had to get it see i'm just going to order it did not like the color or did not probably like the way i see people complain and say it's too big maybe it was too big for you know whatever area they wanted it for so they returned it and then it became like new which is still new and i got it here, you want to put this in your room? You do? Okay, you can hold it. Okay, so my daughter wants to it in her room. No, 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 hold it by the screen. Hold it by the bottom. You're going to hurt it, damage it all by the screen. Yeah, and the charger is here. The charger for it is right here. Okay, so that's that. Next item. I gotta say, I didn't have no use for it, but I was not gonna pass that sale. No way. So I always buy these spray bottles at Target, and they're they're just awesome. I love them. And it's from a core company called Everspring. It's a glass bottle, and I always tell people, you know, when you buy bottles and you put chemicals in them, like bleach. After a while, the, the spray doesn't work because of the chemical. It get blocked up and start acting crazy it never happened with these bottles you know, no matter what you put in there bleach any chemical never happened with these this, this is why i love these these are absolutely great excellent quality um spray bottles so of course i ordered another one So now I have three. 
Mm -hmm. I'm obsessed with these. And I put them, I put bleach in them. These are my bleach bottles and I label them bleach. Put the label bleach right here. And that's what I use them for. On my Clorox cleanup, I, I put them in the bathroom, kitchen, stuff like that under the sink. And that's what I use. All right, so I got this from Target. It's a riser. I really do like it. It's very sturdy. I just love the way it looks. It's very unique, very different. Um, it's a Target truss hole. And it's... Hold on. It says clean with damp cloth. Hold on. Yeah. And it's wood guys i guess with like a spray finish on it i like it i'm gonna put it in my bathroom i have so many i got from my bathroom i got from um bed bath and not the bath um from home goods but they the reason i don't like them is because they have the way how they're built they kind of store water i don't like the ones that store water it's it's just get very annoying to keep clean every day so this one because it's flat it won't store any water the water will just run right off of it so it won't sell the other ones are like dishes you know what i'm saying you know those ones that store waters so i like this it's kind of big for my bathroom counter because my bathroom counter is not that big but i measured it and it will fit and this oh this i'll have to show you guys it's something that i ordered i ordered the cube the cube um storage for my kids room you know where you have the little cube um boxes let me take it out and show you guys the storage bin yeah storage bin um i'm not out to show you guys i'm going to show you guys when i'm done with that and i was to pick it up in store i was supposed to pick up this this the cube um storage in in the store that actually um I don't know what's the word to use. It's the what is it called? It's a storage, but I don't know what it's called. But anyway, but these goes inside of it. And when I went to go pick it up in the store, the guy said he he didn't see the order. And when I went online and looked, no, when he scanned the um, barcode, he came back with only these bags. So I said, "You don't see anything else." He was like, "No." I said I ordered something else and I went and looked and it says it's now for shipping so I don't know why they decide to change it from pickup in store to shipping I don't know so that's what I did they changed it to shipping so I only got these to go inside of it and I ordered three of these and they only had two in stock and chose, they told me it was a different store and I said being that they're going to ship their ship their the main part of that the main base for this I just put shipping for everything so I'm supposed to get more of these in black and white but different design so when that's there and I set it up I'm going to show you guys I don't want to rattle about it and can't show it to you I hate to do that because it's not here so when that come okay i got one more stuff wow i was really shopping this week and this you should see my floor guys so many open papers and garbage and boxes so this water bottle i got from amazon i had went to um to Burlington and got me one but I saw my son with this he has it in white and he said mom I said where you get that from me he said mom I got it off of Amazon for ten dollars I was like what and he was like yeah you know it has a part it has a part where you can you can use a straw home oh, yeah right here you can use a straw or you can just open it right here if you don't want to use a straw and drink from here and i was like wow because the one that i have only has a straw and i thought that was so interesting and i like this little thing to carry it was just so dope 
and it keeps your stuff cold for 24 hours but my son says even 48 hours his stuff water was still cold it says not for use with hot or carbonated beverage so it's not for hot or carbonated beverage but it's for cold and it's only for water that we use it for so hey the one that my son has though has like a rough texture the white has a rough texture this one is a more smooth texture which is cool i like this because the one that he has had like the white one and it was rough and he had to um bleach it because it looked he got dirty and he couldn't get the dirt off just by wiping it off because of the texture so he had to bleach around it and wash it and it came off so it was much harder to clean this one smooth so it's going to be easier for me to clean and i love it so this is going to be my new water bottle for work i know i showed you guys in one of my last videos not my last video but one of my videos when i went to um burlington and got you know the other one which i'm no longer going to be carrying even though that one is good keeps my stuff cold as well when i got from burlington so this is one this is from a company called m cool and i'm going to link it of course in the description just in case you want to go and buy it because i really love the way how it feels sturdy my son said he's so he, he's so obsessed with his and i feel like i'm going to be obsessed with mine so yeah that's all that i have i don't have anything else to show you guys i can't wait to set everything up and show you guys what you know the outcome look like but yeah but that's it for this video i'm gonna wrap it up so don't forget to like share and subscribe until next time peace